and here we are in the finals against the uh, blue white skies deck which we're gonna probably lose to but we're gonna play we're not gonna mulligan um, we're gonna have turn one captive and then turn two pump and then turn three watch keep turn four guy curve out He's playing like Don Tread, or sorry, he was Green White Flyers, but he's playing Drawn Don Tread or Elk and stuff like that to fix his mana. Oh, that might be better. Depends on his play. If he plays Don Tread or Elk, I'll attack first. If it's not, I will play Strangle Root Geist. Exactly. Let the beat commence! Taking four on turn two is pretty... Yeah. Do you have a two-two to play? Make me sad if he had a 2-2. Two -two. Then I'm actually not going to attack with this guy. This guy I will. Because this I'll trade with a 2-2 two -two any day of the week. If he doesn't have a spell, swing for 4 more. I mean, he has Midnight Haunting. Which is something to keep in mind. But... Um... Question is, would I be willing to run into Midnight Haunting? give him value off it. he get that guy, and then i play a watch keep. Yeah, I think if he wants if he wants to get there with the thing, because I don't know if he has it or not, I think that's... Yeah, he has it. There's the Midnight Haunting. Ah, fortunate. Oh, rebuke. Okay. Well, eventually that was going to kill something, so better kill my one drop. Maybe he's going to cast a flyer of some sort. Oh, do I cast the Tormented Prior or do I just let this guy flip? I think I'm just gonna let my guy flip. Gonna attack with the Geist. And I'll just pass. Now let him get value of his Cathar right away. Silver Claw Griffin would be good. But Bane would take him. Yeah. Well, let's see what he's got. I think it's Silver Claw Griffin. Smite. Oh, that's that was value. That's fine. You can attack me for two. I will play a Pariah. Triangle Geist is so good. Harvest Pirate is also a good draw since it's not a land. Um, and I've got two cards in the yard, which is pretty good in that sense. Three. Oh, right, he's played as Vorapede too, which is probably why. Oh, no. Sweet. I forgot. He's Vorapede.deck. Yeah, I'll definitely Harvest Fire his Silver Claw Griffin. Question is do I do it pre or post combat? If I do it pre and I attack with Strangle Root Geist, if I attack with both, he'll put Cath he'll put Griffin in front of Geist, Cathar in front of that, so that way he makes his Silver Claw Griffin big, and then I could Harvest Pyre in response, or he puts that in front of that, and that in front of that, 
in which case I still harvest fire in response. Yeah, so I'm going to harvest fire in response to whatever um, uh, thing he's going to do after his Cathar trigger. So we'll trade those, and then I'll kill Silver, Silver Claw Griffin. So it's a two for two. Okay. First strike. Okay. Okay. In response to that. And just in case. He has the plus one, plus one for one. So yeah, I traded a Harvest Pyre and a 3-2 for a 3-2 Flyer for a strike and a thing. Villagers. Not a land. Hmm. Do I attack with the guys? He'll trade it right away. If I don't, he has a 4-6, so... Is more trouble than it's worth for that rack with madness. Otherwise, I got. Yeah, I got three damage in there. Sweet. No spell. He can have a 4 6. I don't want to trade my guys for it, but if he attacks, yeah, he is. Gonna cast a spell, nope. Yeah, well. Uh, you could have Midnight Haunting. Which, if it is, it is. It's a blowout, so be it. Whoa, whoa! He's just gonna play it post-combat, or pre-combat. I don't want to trade a Geist for two spirits. Got two cards in hand. Yeah, you got me there. And do I have anything that makes me want to play another land? Nope. So I won't. Attack me for four. Oh, five, six. Okay. That's okay. Play a giant creature. Play something I can rack with madness and then just win. I think that might have been a little bit greedy on his part. Unless he's got two creatures. Spidery grasp. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> attack with both. He's going to want to attack there, so then I'll rack with Madness his creature, then Ulvenwald Bear itself. Okay. Lethal on two creatures. Just leave his guy back. His guys. He's got two cards in it, one card in hand, and it better be a good one. Otherwise, Brimstone Volley, he's just dead, which is the range I always want to be in. Yeah, good. 
Yay! I have a 7-7. Seven, seven. That was a good one to draw. <laughs> Bam! <clears throat> Ninja Snake! He has to have another good top deck. That is not a good top deck. Yep. Shoo! Got there, and I was not drawing anything for a while. Yes! Actually, now let's see. What do I want to play against him since he's playing all flyers? That's probably not good. I'm not going to change anything. 